Okay, this is a quick video to show how to install mods with Mod Organizer 2. Uh, when you install mods manually and then merge other files or mods into them. So we're going to do two today. We're going to do uh, 4A's New Idols in Skyrim, which includes the Creatures Pack and the Spells Pack that will merge into the main mod. And then we'll also install Closed Face Helmets, wherever it was. I've already downloaded these. So anyhow, we will install Closed Face Helmets and then Improved Closed Face Helmets with the WACCF uh, patch. Um, we're going to merge this file into the other mod, Improved Closed Face Helmets because this mod is an ESP replacer only. It fully replaces the original ESP in closed face helmets here. Okay. So let's get started. We're going to start with Finis first. And the first thing we want to install is the behavior pack, which is the main file. So we just double click here. Now, if we'll note, this says no game data on top level. That means that this is not the data folder. This is the data folder. This is actually what we want to be the top level folder. So we're going to right click and set, tell it to set data directory. Now, it says here that it all looks good. And we can see that the data directory is here with meshes, scripts, source, tools, finis, ESP. So we're going to click OK to allow that to install. There we go. Now that that's installed, we want to install the finished creature pack and the finished spells. The only thing is, there's no need to have these as separate mods. So what we're going to do is merge these into the original behavior files. Now let me show you real quick what we're looking at. So if we have our mods folder here, we can see that MO installs all of its mods into this mods folder. And you can see that that is the top level folder, which is data. What we're going to do is the other two, we are going to merge just straight into this mod right here. What happens is when you run MO2 and it populates the virtual folders, it's going to grab this one. It's going to change the name of this to data so that this will be in Skyrim in common Skyrim data folder. So now we want to install the creature pack. One thing to make sure of is that this name here matches this name here. As long as it does, then we see we have a match, so now we just click manual. Again, we have a no game data on top. We want to go to the data directory, set data. Now, when we click OK now, it's going to bring up this pop-up. It's going to ask us if we want to merge this mod into this one, replace it. So, in other words, it will empty this folder out and put this in there, which we don't want to do, or rename it the new one we're making so that it would be a separate uh, uh, mod. We're going to choose merge. So let's do the same for the spells. Manual. Again, no game data on top. Set data directory. Okay, this one will have a finished spells ESP so we'll be able to see it in the mod folder this time. Again, we're going to choose OK, then merge. Let it do its thing. Now, if we look in the mods, whoops, wrong one. If we look in the mods folder now and look in forays, we'll see that Finnis Spells has been added here, as well as its uh, scripts and meshes and tools were also added in. So it's just combining three separate mods into one single one makes left pane management much easier. Now let's move on to closed face helmets and click the wrong thing. 
move on to closed face helmets. Once we get, there's no installation instructions here for it, so we can just install it straight away. And improve closed face helmets. Manual. Again, we have no game data on top level, so set data directory. There we go. Now, improve closed face helmets is installed. Now we're going to install the this one and if we note the names do not match and it doesn't give us a name that matches so we're going to have to make it match. Also it appears that with MO capitals matter. If I were to leave this with the improved close face elements capitalized then it would have put it in as a different mod. So we're going to manual and you can see this only has the Imperial Helm Legend ESP which is the exact same ESP that comes with this. This one's actually packaged correctly because we have the looks good here and data folder is at the top level. Again we're going to choose merge and improved close face helmets is you can see Imperial Helm Legend ESP is exactly the same. So and that's pretty much it.